All right, good morning everyone, it's August 17, 2023, and in this video I want to talk to you about a stock that I believe um, has some, I think had a lot of potential, a lot of potential, in, uh, serious potential, because lately we see in pretty insanely big amounts, a lot of funds taking positions ahead of time, and this stock does have an FDA fast track designation, and you know, it, it, it's you can't help but wonder. You can't just ignore this stock after you see that, you know, the amount of uh, funds that are pouring money into this right now. Which, by the way, it would involve a new drug that, if approved, would, would come into the market to treat the specific um, uh, disorder that hasn't seen a new drug treatment in at least two decades. All right, in order to end the suspense, guys, let's just look at the filings real quick. So. 13G filings. We're going to start with August 7, 2023. And by the way, the ticket symbol was VTGN. It was the stock that I'm talking about in this video, guys. And we see right here that we have Commodore Capital LP. They took a 19.7% stake on August 17, 2023. On October 2, 2023, we can see Great Point Partners LLC at a 9.99% stake. If we go on October 4th, 2023, we can see 0.72 Asset Management LP, they took a 5.8% stake. And then if we come again on October 4th, 2023, Citadel Advisors, all right, Citadel, everybody is very familiar with them, 5.6% stake. And then on October 4th, 2023, we have Biotechnology Value Fund, which also took a 5.2% stake. So that's a lot of stakes, that's a lot of funds getting in and at a um, you know recent time and like i said the stock has a uh, oh, oh i'm sorry we also have another one we forgot we also have another one tcg crossover with 7.5 percent stake that's also on october 4th all right so mission and investment highlights all right so we're going to talk about uh, uh tickets and we're talking about tickets on vtgn we are focused on delivering a new generation of cns therapies with novel mechanisms for action targeting a broad diverse range of cns disorders six cns clinical programs lead candidate with reason positive phase three data in social anxiety disorder i think you would agree with me that most funds who have gotten into this they got into it for the phase three right and it's been a positive phase three and in fact this is the phase three that got fast track designation by the fda which we can look here at the clinical stage pipeline the phase three and it says here positive type uh, top line results uh from the phase two trial they're now into already in phase three uh, and that was the the positive results had they were released on august 2023 FDA fast track designation. We also have guys fast FDA fast track designation for a phase two that they're doing. They also have an FDA fast track designation for a phase one. But most likely we're focused on phase three. So if we are to get into this stock, Vista Gen, right, is the name of the company, VTG is the ticket symbol. If you were to get in, right now at this point in time, you would get in for three reasons the fast track designation, that it's in phase three. You would get in only if you had read the trial results and thought that they were good and the stock is uh, definitely headed in the positive direction. Or most likely, most people, because they're not gonna read anything about the trial results, they're just gonna buy because of many funds that got into this stock and thinking, you know what, if they're in, I'll take a position. Sometimes they say, let the other person do the thinking for me. I'm not saying that that's how it should be, but you know, it is what it is. So fast track guys is, what is fast track designation? Fast track designation process designed to facilitate the development and expedite the review of drugs to treat serious conditions and fill unmet medical need, right? So it's very important that um, we focus on companies that get fast track designation because most likely something positive might come out of this for something that is very serious and there is a medication that is needed to come out. So it has been two decades since a new SAD therapy was approved. Now if we go to some news that we can look at, which can go back months, like, like this one, September 12, 2023, Vistagen announces positive results for exploratory phase 2A study of PH80 for acute management syndromes of uh, premenstrual dysphoric 
disorder. Vistagen and Fuji enter into exclusive negotiations agreement for a potential license to develop and commercialize Vistagen's investigational monopausal hot flash therapy. Um, that was actually announced, I think, about two weeks ago or three or just recently. Subsequent to release of positive phase three trial results, Vistagen provides corporate update on reports for fiscal 2024 first quarter financial results. And they do have some cash that they can still go through for 2024. Vistagen announces positive top line results for phase three, which we've talked about already. The analysts, surprisingly, and there's been many, it's not just one analyst, there's been many. You can see who the analysts are. You can look that up and see who they are, what their names are, who they work for, and what their history is. Is as as far as um, um, uh, how good have they, how good they have been with their ratings at predicting, you know, did their ratings come out true? Have they been good at predicting what the stock should be? You can see that, right? So it's good to see that instead of just going blindly because you might have some analyst who sucks really bad. I mean, like trash analyst who has been horrible, who has negative results and gives some crazy price target that you like to see. And you think, okay, this is great. The analyst said it's going to go up, right? But you can look at that. You can get, you guys can see that on stockanalysis.com. So if you go to stockanalysis.com, click on forecast, scroll down. You can see who the analysts are, read about them and so on. I'm not endorsing stockanalysis.com and I have nothing to do with them. I actually just use the free version, to be honest. So Vista Gen Therapeutics, VTGN is the ticket symbol. It closed at 317 and during after hours, it went up to $3.42. Now, with that being said, guys i think that this is a stock that i personally can't ignore because of the funds that have poured money into this they must know something i'm guessing at the very very least i think the stock will end up going up before the fda decision whatever that fda decision would be i don't know if it's gonna be positive or not so that's the way i see it um doesn't mean that you should trade and you should never trade according to my videos always, always do your own due diligence i want to wish you guys all the best and take care are you looking for a Discord platform that offers a first-class trading community? That's what you can expect when you join Bull Market Watch. Trading can be challenging for some people, but we're here to simplify the process for you. We have a very powerful track record. Our Discord deals with day trades, swing trades, and long-term trades. Hundreds of traders operate through our Discord where we come up with stocks to trade for profits on the NASDAQ and in YSE. With a low monthly subscription of $9.90, you will have full access to our Discord where you can interact with other traders and get all the latest news when it comes to trading as well. It's a community that is extremely supportive of one another and always willing to help each other out. Become a member of Bull Market Watch today and be on your way to a better financial situation.